Nurturing Leadership in Children, a Guide to Raising Kids to be Leaders. Raising children to be leaders is one of the most empowering gifts parents and educators can offer. In today's fast-paced and dynamic world, leadership skills equip children with the confidence, resilience, and problem-solving abilities they need to navigate challenges effectively. Instilling leadership qualities in children does not mean grooming them to be assertive or demanding but rather nurturing essential traits like responsibility, empathy, and self-confidence. Cultivating these qualities from a young age helps children develop into well-rounded, capable individuals who can positively influence those around them. Here's how parents, caregivers, and teachers can inspire the next generation to become natural leaders. 1. Encourage decision-making and accountability. One of the best ways to nurture leadership in children is by encouraging them to make decisions from an early age. Giving children the freedom to make choices, whether they're small, like picking what to wear, or more significant, such as deciding on an extracurricular activity, fosters a sense of independence. When kids understand that their choices have consequences, they also learn accountability, an essential leadership trait. For instance, if they choose not to study for a test and receive a low grade, they gain insight into the connection between effort and outcomes. This experience helps children understand that their actions matter, building confidence and reinforcing the importance of taking responsibility. 2. Model Empathy and Effective Communication Leaders need to understand and relate to others, making empathy a core trait. Parents and educators can model empathy by listening actively to children, acknowledging their feelings, and showing them how to view situations from different perspectives. Teaching children to express themselves effectively, using words to articulate thoughts, feelings, and needs, builds strong communication skills. When children learn to listen to others and convey their ideas respectfully, they develop the capacity to lead with empathy and build trust with their peers. Role-playing different scenarios at home, such as resolving conflicts or sharing ideas in a group, can help them practice these skills in a safe environment. 3. Foster Resilience and Growth Mindset Leadership is often about navigating challenges and setbacks, which makes resilience a crucial skill for future leaders. Teaching children that failure is a part of learning can help them develop a growth mindset, a belief that abilities and intelligence can be developed through effort. When children understand that mistakes are opportunities to learn rather than setbacks, they are less likely to give up when faced with adversity. Parents can support this by celebrating effort rather than just achievements. For example, praising children for the hard work they put into a task, even if it didn't go as planned, reinforces the value of perseverance. This approach instills a sense of confidence in their ability to grow, adapt, and overcome difficulties. 4. Encourage teamwork and collaboration. Leadership is not only about individual accomplishments, it often involves working with others toward a common goal. Encouraging children to engage in group activities, whether through sports, school projects, or community events, helps them understand the dynamics of teamwork. In collaborative settings, children learn to listen to others' perspectives, compromise, and value diverse contributions. They also learn to navigate conflicts and understand that success is often the result of collective effort. When children experience the importance of working together, they naturally develop qualities of inclusivity and respect, traits essential for effective leaders. 5. Set goals and cultivate self-motivation. Setting and working toward goals is a fundamental aspect of leadership. Helping children set realistic, achievable goals, whether academic, personal, or extracurricular, fosters a sense of purpose and motivation. Parents and teachers can guide children in breaking down larger goals into smaller, manageable steps. Celebrating milestones along the way encourages persistence and self-motivation, which are critical qualities for leaders. For example, if a child aims to improve in a specific subject, parents can support them by creating a study plan, offering guidance, and celebrating each bit of progress. As children learn to set and achieve their own goals, they gain confidence in their ability to influence their own lives, an empowering realization that inspires leadership. 6. Provide opportunities for leadership roles. 
Finally, one of the most effective ways to raise children to be leaders is by giving them real opportunities to practice leadership. This could be as simple as letting them plan a family activity, assigning them responsibilities around the house, or encouraging them to take on leadership roles in school or community projects. When children are given the responsibility to lead, they develop skills like organization, decision-making, and time management. These experiences teach them what it means to lead by example, manage their responsibilities, and support others in achieving a shared objective. Conclusion Raising children to be leaders is not about pushing them to command others, it's about helping them develop the internal qualities that make a person influential, compassionate, and resilient. When parents and educators focus on nurturing decision-making, empathy, resilience, collaboration, self-motivation, and responsibility, they set children up for success. Leadership is not a title, it is a set of qualities and behaviors that help individuals positively impact their communities. By instilling these traits in children from a young age, we can guide them to grow into thoughtful, effective leaders who will contribute meaningfully to the world around them.